the rodeo, it's been a problem from the get-go. It, it affects me the same way. I've lost about $300,000 in the last five, six years. Just the cost of doing business and trying to get a committee to catch up to your cost. And the Cowboys, their commitment, they never can catch up to their cost. It, it's all doable because I really believe that it should have happened in the PRCA, but the inability to change how something was created 80, 90, or 100 years ago has stayed the same. I know that the greatest icon in the world is the American cowboy, and we can't sell it because we don't have the ability to sell it. You are going to create something that you'll demand on what they do and the rules they'll go by, and you'll make it work for them. So it's a great thing that you're doing. I don't know where you've been the last 10 years, but you you could be the savior of this whole thing. Rodeo will not exist in California in the next 20, 25 years if we don't create the fan base and the support that it needs. You and I know if you can create a fan base that knows Trevor Brazil, they will go to four or five or six events a year to go see him. you are almost got a selection committee that's going to take a look at, I, I want to know your education, I want to know how you speak in front of a camera. And are you are you competitive enough? You can't just let somebody, because you like his personality and everything else. We need somebody that's willing to show how great the American cowboy is. And you're the guy that's going to have to do it. That trail ride that goes on right there in San Ynez Valley has probably 150 guys that would love to be involved in rodeo one way or another. I really believe there's 45 corporations or individuals that would love to own a team that would put up three or four hundred thousand dollars. Rodeo needs a savior right now, and it will never happen in the PRCA. If you took them the greatest plan in the world, they couldn't figure out what you were even talking about. Don't let somebody tweak what you have in your thought process. Let what doesn't work and does work be your process, and you're going to get there a lot faster and a lot better.